The thing about St Mary's Cathedral in Glasgow is that it's uh, really got quite a heritage in this area in that it's a place where years ago um, Gay Switchboard used to meet uh, and that, that was at a time when Switchboard couldn't find a place to meet in Glasgow in the city that was safe uh, and this place gave a home to it for a little while. Um, more recently there's been a gay group here, there's been gay members of staff, I'm a gay man myself. The gay group meets monthly but it's a group of people that kind of blend into the congregation on a Sunday morning. This isn't a gay church, it's a church for everybody. Um, and that's one of the reasons that people like coming here. I think people in the churches do have an ethical duty to promote equality. I think that people in the churches need to think, need to think things through and realise that actually the church has been a very negative voice to gay people. And instead of that negative voice, what needs to be heard is a message of respect, of love, of inclusion. And I know hundreds of people in the churches who believe in that message, who are getting it out, who are talking about it on Facebook, on Twitter, online, in gay groups, in churches. But it's not just about gay people now. It's straight members of my congregation as well that want this. The message to anyone that's gay and religious is that they are absolutely, utterly loved. And church is a place, religious communities are places where that message should be going out loud and clear. Um, I'm a gay man. I feel utterly loved at church. And the, the only message that I can give, spread, extend, to other people is that church should be a place where you're utterly loved and if you can't find one locally you'll find one not much further away because churches are changing these days and, and thank God they are.